We felt so behind, there was no time for delay. The science made no sense, yet a test in three days. I sat there with Susie. We reviewed and reviewed. Giving up, I said, I just haven't a clue. Pages to read, I just can't comprehend. How removing heat turns a liquid to a solid by end. Then Theo chimed in, apparently eavesdropping again, and said, Aha! I have an idea. One so brilliant and creative, giving and innovative, that we can share with district-wide peers. Hear what I say, just listen to me. This idea can save us, and others, from science misery. Rather than a book issued to us of dry text, what if we created a book written in kid terms to explain the complex? A comic book, if you will, one to be read by our friends, revised with research and fact checks, where high interest transcends. Comic books hold interest, abstract facts into art, a storyline, characters, and humor from a textbook sets apart. A publishing company we could begin, print copies, then e-versions to download again, to share our comic books with other schools, districts, states. It's a win-win project only if we could create. But create with what? I ask, not to be rude. But how could we do such with our resources at school? Why, let's partner with Pixton. They have comic tools galore. With them, we can create any comic scenario and more. But the technology, we need it, okay? How could that be? Maybe, my friend, we could apply for a grant through Pepsi. So here you have it, the public who holds the power in your vote. Don't you think our class idea is one worthy to promote? <laughs>